Hello there, Pokemon. Professor Chaz here, wishing you a very happy birthday. I just want to say thank you for 20 years of fun and exciting adventures across six generations of games. I've been there with you right from the start. My actual first Pokemon game ever on my original Game Boy was Pokemon Blue. But the first introduction I really had into the series was when I was flipping through Nintendo Power one month, and there was this little insert in the back. A short little strategy guide on the first several areas in the game. As soon as I saw that cute little Squirtle, I knew I had to get this game, and Squirtle was going to be my starter, no questions asked. Despite the fact that I might appear to be more of a Charizard fan. You know, Charizard is cool, but Squirtle is Squirtle. Now, something I really like about the franchise of Pokemon is, in comparison to other RPGs in which you just battle random enemies for experience, then move on to the next area, you actually get to take those enemies and recruit them to your team and start leveling them up as well. And in later areas of the game, you'll find stronger versions of the enemies you fight in previous areas of the game. And in Pokemon, your own team can actually build into those higher forms. And that's always had a really cool, interesting appeal to me. Like, you never quite know exactly when your Pokemon is going to hit that stage and evolve into the next form, and it's been really exciting along the way. Now, one of my favorite things to do in the world of Pokemon is collect ribbons for certain events. So the team that I'm using in my Alpha Sapphire game, they hail all the way back from the Fire Red game on Game Boy Advance. And I've been uploading my main teams throughout the generations ever since then, and every generation we hit, I try to get as many ribbons for them as possible. Through each generation, I've taken them through Contest, Elite Four, and side games like Pokemon Coliseum to earn as many ribbons as I can get, and I really like how it chronicles all the adventures they've had ever since I first snatched them up inside a Pokeball and brought them along with me for the ride. I'm really excited and looking forward to what the future brings to the world of Pokemon, and all the new discoveries yet to be made, and all the adventures still to be had. So thanks once again for 20 years of fun and excitement, and here's to another 20 and beyond. Cheers, Pokemon.